initiating. It is Sunday, it is a beautiful day, and the best thing by far is that I got my Arduino starter kit. Well, it already arrived yesterday as it turned out, but I didn't, didn't see it. Whatever. So in this vlog, I will unbox and review the most complete starter kit by Elegu. But first, there is a bit more that I bought. So let me unbox this as well. As you can see here, I got myself a transmission belt. This is 10 meters of transition belt. Go big or go home and a few of these pulleys. Nice. Then I also got myself three brackets for these NEMA 17 stepper motors. Two and three. They were around 10 bucks. I think this was around 20 bucks if I'm correct. Not really cheap, but you know, I just wanted it so bad. Check this out. Here I have even more stuff. And there I have another Arduino Uno. Well, this is a Telcum. I don't know, like something else. There I have a CNC shield and four of these motor control units, I think. Very nice. USB cable, very nice. And finally, let's get to the starter kit. This was around 50 bucks, so let's check the quality. So, first of all, this is a rather nice box. Really nice. This is a really nice box, actually. Okay, these are all the parts, all the included parts. Oh my god, that's a that's a lot. Water level detection sound sensor. Yo, damn. Yeah, I got myself a few buttons. Heck yeah. And this starter set is from Elegu. That's the Arduino Uno right there by Elegu. Well, it's Elegu Uno, I guess. So this is from a third party. That's why it is, you know, it's cheap but it should do the trick, so let's check it out. Okay, first of all, that is pretty much the same USB cable right there, same cable. Okay, there are quite a lot of pins for red boards, I guess. That's cool. Oh, there it is. There are a lot of cables, so they seem to be kind of fragile, but I think that's perfectly fine. Oh, nice. An adapter for a 9 volt battery, power plug right there, sweet. And what is this, a motor, DC motor? Oh, it's actually a stepper. Yeah, not too bad, nice. There we have this little joystick, sweet. Damn! Let's put it back in there. Okay, what's that? What the heck is that? Ultrasonic sensor, are you kidding me? No way. This is amazing, this is actually amazing. Okay, what's that? Oh, that's a stepper motor driver board. Even comes with a battery. Sweet. Let me put my other one in there as well. Okay, there we have a servo. So far, this looks decent, like decent quality stuff. Amazing. Oh, that's this water, water level detector, tiny remote right there, and an LCD screen, sweet! There we have a sound sensor, another battery as it seems, I'm not able to find it on this list, little propeller, even this thing is like, it's, it's decent quality, it's, damn, I'm surprised, this is amazing, this looks like the RFID, yeah, seems like it, damn, this is so crazy! RFID, oh my god. This is definitely the future technology. Gotta focus on that good technology. Oh my god, I'm so, I'm so eager to learn. Okay, there we have a DC motor, a five volt relay, seven segment, one digit seven segment display. And there we have four digits. Oh my god, there's even a motion sensor in there. You gotta be kidding me, a freaking motion sensor. Oh my god, the possibilities are endless. I can't believe it. Is that a potential meet? No, it's a rotary encoder mod module. Okay, this is insane. This is, this is so much, so much stuff. Power supply right there. There is so much stuff in here. 
max whatever module oh my god i can't believe it yeah and there's well what's that some sort of a shield i guess a lot of resistors right there oh my god membrane switch module oh my god what say freaking what and there we have this breadboard thingy so let's check it out squishy backside okay this is actually this pretty much the same thing as my old one and wow this is i think you can actually connect them yeah it's it's this is actually the same thing that's funny oh my god i just yeah you actually can connect them it's kind of weird because you have to you have to slide it in from below just like that yeah okay, connect them like sweet now i have a huge breadboard double breadboard oh my god damn i'm i'm surprised this is amazing and here we have LEDs, potentiometers, capacitors, even a few microcontrollers. Oh my god. It looks amazing. I'm definitely surprised by the quality. It looks it looks freaking decent. And yeah, there are so many possibilities, it's crazy. So yeah, the next vlogs will be definitely funny. Yeah, I'm totally looking forward to my next vlogs, to learning all of it, but enough progress for today. Smash that like button the way I smash them bread words together. Bang the bell like crap. Check the recent news on chrisviral.com. And yeah, that's it for today. I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>